Hi, in this video I will show you how to extract the iOS system symbols from iOS 15 with the delete shared cache extractor tool from Keef. So I already have downloaded the firmware for iPhone X, which is an ARM64 device, uh, with iOS version 15. So we can see that here I have this and I will now rename this uh, to a zip file. Now we see I have renamed it and I will unzip the archive, which might take a bit. Now that the extraction process is finished, we have to find the largest DMG file uh, extracted and this is this one here and then from here we just mount the disk, which we can see here that this one here is now mounted and we are interested in the system library and then caches and then we can start from here a new iterm terminal and we can now use the tool which I have already installed via brew uh, so the command will the tool is called delete shared cache extractor we can then use this one to um, to, which, to extract it one word of advice uh, if you have multiple Xcode versions make sure that you have Xcode 13 installed and this is uh, the active version here so uh, now that we have this kind of information. Uh, let's just check that we uh, have an ARM64. Uh, so and then we have to have to extract that, and I will then do so. Um, I by constructing uh, the command that is the tool name. It's the uh, directory uh, containing the, the ARM64 here, the cache, and then my target directory into which one I want to extract this information. And then we should see in a short that the extraction process will be started. Yes, looks good. And we can also then see here in the finder that in the DSIM folder the, the DLIPS will be extracted and the process is complete.